Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part two of Let's Play Bloodborne. Alright, in the last episode, we woke up here after getting destroyed by a wolf. And then found ourselves able to go back to the sick room. But now we found our way to Central Yarnum as well. Now I could go back to the sick room, because wasn't there a door that I could have gone to? Like, past where the uh, beast was? Why don't I go check that out? Because I want to do a bit of exploring before we go back to Central Yarnum. Sound good? Huh. <laughs> Well, it's not like you guys have a choice, now do you? Also, buddy, anybody that's here from the first episode, thank you so much for still checking out this Let's Play and not giving up after the first episode. Because usually that is, like, a common trend. Like, some people watch the first part and then they move on. I don't think I've been up these stairs, have I? Wait, does it even open? Oh, wait a minute, there's someone to talk to. Are you... out on the hunt? Maybe. Then I'm very sorry, but I cannot open this door. I am Yosefka. The patients here in my clinic must not be exposed to infection. I know that you hunt for us, for our town, but I'm sorry. Please. This is all that I can do. Oh, Yosefka's blood vial. Now, go. And good hunting. Indeed. <laughs> Alright, so what does that blood vial even do compared to the other ones? Invigorates the senses, restoring a larger amount of HP. Ah, okay, so it's a much better blood vial. I'll hold on to that for later. So, I'm just gonna head back to Central Yarna. That's really, that's all there was to this place. Good thing I came back just to get, like, an upgraded vial. Unfortunately, it doesn't do anything with all the other vials. Alright, so this is pretty much your central point to warp to anywhere. It's too bad you can't just take the, uh, warp in the, uh, sick room and go to Central Yarnum that way. Nope, you gotta go to the middleman first, each time. Well, if that's how it's gotta be done, it's gotta be done. So, simple as that. <laughs> also, I'm noticing that if you upgrade your trick weapon to be two-handed, you're not holding the pistol. I only just realized that when I was fooling around with it. Okay, looks like I haven't gone this way yet. Oh, hello. What's this? Oh, a pebble. That's probably something I can use to attack enemies from a distance. Oh, hello. Oh, he's dual wielding. Oh, was that worth a bullet? I don't think it was. You know what, whatever. I did it. So I'm glad he's gone. I gotta keep my eyes peeled in case somebody else wants to approach. Oh, this one got a shield! I think I might need this. There we go. <laughs> Also, I forgot to mention this, and I noticed this when I was looking at the first episode. You heal HP whenever you hit an enemy. So, keep that in mind. Also, that's a huge mob. Don't know if I want to aggro them just yet. So, let me just get my sneak on. <laughs> and look around a bit more. Hold on, is that the gate I saw before? Oh, here it is! There's the device! Alright, so it looks like we got ourselves a shortcut opened. 
That way, if I end up going back to the uh, lantern, I can just walk through this gate and be back where I left off. You don't even drop a lot of uh, blood echoes, like 48 on these guys. That's a shame. Oh my god, look at the size of that weapon. Should I engage him? May not be the best idea, but let's go for it. Whoa, okay. Oh, okay, he's got a counterattack. Yeah, see, like that big headbutt? Got him. A tempering blood gemstone? What is that? Huh, blood gem contact. So that's our first one. Okay, it doesn't show up here. I guess it will be an inventory. Like, let me look through all this. Tempering blood gemstone. Healing church blood gem rarity. The rarer the gem, the more potent it is. Okay, so increases my physical attack by 1.1%. I'm guessing you can equip that to a weapon? I'm not sure. So that fight could have gone a lot better. Had to heal a couple times. But at least I survived, so that's all that matters to me. So this was purely optional to go this way. It was only just to get that blood gem. From the looks of things, I might have to aggro that huge mob. Actually, they're kind of separated. So I might be able to get one or two of them. And start picking them off piece by piece. Hello? Last you come on. You gotta put that door on and know how to hunt. Avoid with you. Now. Last you come on. You gotta put that door on and know how to hunt. Avoid with you. Now. I was double checking to see if he'd say something else. But no. Uh oh. Don't know if I want to like, engage them, you know, where they're all facing me. This could be a disaster. So I think I'm gonna wait for them to like start walking back the other way and hit them from behind. I think that might be the best thing to do. How far is our patrol route anyway? Did they go all the way to the door? Come on, turn around. Turn around so I can cheap shot the lot of ya. Taking them all on at once could definitely be a terrible idea. Maybe I only aggroed one of them so far. If that's the case, good for me. Oh. Ow. Dumb hit like that, but that's okay. All right. This town's finished. It willing them down. Oh my god, there's still more. God, there's still like three or four of them already. How is there still that many dudes? Okay, it's all going according to plan. Now, I know I could probably take out some of them in one hit. But I don't want to chance it. Because what if I get flanked? Oh. Oh, you just left yourself exposed. Good job. Huh. There we go. 
Now it looked like a mob of five or six is now down to two. See, you gotta take your time with this kind of stuff. Otherwise, you're in a heap of trouble. Simple as that. Actually, I think that's where I came from. Wait. There's something else up here. Time for singing. Guess I could have used the cocktail, too. Hello. Are you that outsider? Well, sorry, but I don't want anything to do with you. Trot along, will ya? Oh, everyone is just so nice. In this old Victorian environment. <laughs> With a lot of HP Lovecraft elements. Maybe I can find someone that'll be just as generous to see me. Lads, you come on. Oh, I already knocked on this door. Okay, that, I think that's the last of the mob. Oh! How did I forget about you? You were not even with the mob. But you'd attack me anyway, if you had the chance. Uh-oh. Ooh, almost left myself vulnerable. A bloodstone shard. So there's another item I need to look at. Trust it's safe over here. Embed and weapon to fortify. Okay. Well, I can't do that yet. You know, I could have used the cocktail on that mob. Whoa! Okay, I don't always get blood from my enemies. So I notice my health has not increased since then. Maybe it's only in certain attacks. Like maybe the visceral attack is the one thing that heals you. Remember, I haven't really played this game before until now. Uh oh. I hear somebody running towards me too. Yeah, I think we're gonna start using some of these cocktails. How kind of you to keep giving me more. Can I go beyond this gate? No. Can you let me in? That's not even a door to open. Two blood vials, and that's it. Hey. Pay attention to me. Now, yeah, these guys are easy because they only go for one swing at a time and then they're left vulnerable. Like, other enemies will probably do some nasty combos. And maybe some of them will have guns too. That's another thing we gotta watch out for. Hold on, is that entire mob gone? Hang on. Okay, that did not work as I hoped. <laughs> I was gonna like chuck it over the fence. That is not the way. Oh, apparently there was an update for Neo 2. I haven't played that in weeks, if not months. Did the other guys just give up? Here's one for you as well. Oh, that one's got a gun. Is the other one going to try to go up the fence? No. Doesn't look like it. Maybe he's not paying attention to me. Uh-oh. I can't go around the wagon. That's going to make things problematic. Or... Okay, I think I'm just gonna have to do this. 
Uh oh, uh oh. This might be a bad idea. How rude of you! I like being alive! Oh, that was close. Oh, holy shit. How did I survive this... This rabble? What the hell is up with that door? Is someone trying to break through? I think someone's trying to break out. Uh -oh. Doggo. No. Bad boy! Bad boy! I'm gonna have to put you down. I didn't want it to be like this, but I had no choice. It was you or me. What the? How dare you shoot at me? That's rude. You have to ask first before you can put a bullet into my chest. Give me some time to say no. Where the hell is a cold blood do? What does the do do? Use to gain blood echoes. Okay, so that's just a way to try to level up faster. Okay. Wait, why is this set of Quicksilver bullets different? Oh, you know what? I think I'm at the max. So they had to go on reserve. I see. Before I go with that door, let me go over this way. Yeah, they're just gonna go in storage, I think. Oh my god, are you kidding me? There's even more hunters? At least I think- yeah, I don't think these are hunters. They're just barbecue now. Yeah, I think we're on the other side of the street. Yeah, I've been through all this. Oh, man. Like, this is only the first part of the game, too. And already you feel like you're going against insurmountable odds. So I can deal with that gate. Or I can check out in this direction. I think that big beast is very hangry. I don't want to be provoking anything that's going to slaughter me just yet. Let me go this way. I might find another lantern so I can warp back. Can't get a good view of what's banging on the gate. It might be a bad idea to go down there too. Hello. I don't reckon you're from around here. Well, stuck outside on a night of the hunt. Oh, you poor, poor thing. <laughs> I'll have you know I'm doing just fine. I mean, the health might tell a whole different story, but I think I'm doing okay. Only I can just find another, uh, checkpoint. What the hell? Crows? They can't even fly! What hideous looking creatures. An oil urn? Trying to make things more flammable. Wait. I'm hearing chimes. Where's that coming from? I don't know. I don't think I want to let this guy out just yet. <laughs> just saying. You know, for my own good. Let's forego that decision. I 
hear footsteps. You thinking someone's gonna chase me? Good to know he's still preoccupied with the door. And not focusing on me. What a leap. I've got quite a lot of jumping momentum here. Oh, great. There's even more of these jerks. Even got a dog with him now. Ow! I think I got more than one enemy with the cocktail. Holy crap. Oh. Oh, you know what? I'd probably get the health back. Like, you know, anything that's past the right line. Like, if I hit someone before it goes down, I can get that health back, I think. Oh, no. Well, that's one way to solve that problem. Oh, got the parry timing just right. <laughs> I think it would have been a bit different if I used the blunderbuss instead. I would imagine a high damage weapon would probably be a bit slower. So at least big boy's out of the way. And let's see if there's anything else here. Man, I would really like to level up pretty soon. Ooh. It's getting a bit chilly now. Great. More doggos. That's just what I need. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Another bloodstone shard. Man, I really hate to lose all these echoes if I were to die and then not get back here. So it looks like I have a long way to go. I'm gonna find myself a way to create a shortcut. If I go this way, it'll help. Mm. Noise is very disturbing. Huh, pebbles. Now I'm above the street. That's fine and all, but is there no ladder to kick down? Guess not. I don't see another lever or anything. Oh my god, look at all these shards I'm getting. <laughs> it's pretty nice. Still not out of the woods. Hope I didn't miss anything important. Because that would suck. All right, guess we're gonna have to do this. I'll get their attention. If they're gonna be coming this way or not. Oh God, they have a lot more health than I thought. Oh god. I'm gonna die. If I don't, I'll be surprised. Ah, oh, did that too early. Go away! Seriously! Stop! And I'm dead. Oh, I'm so close. Oh man, I gotta. I gotta run all the way back there, don't I? <laughs> Cause I don't think I got another lantern. Oh, that's brutal. <laughs> like how long was that walk to another lantern? 
Yep, all the way back to the beginning. Does not open from this side. I didn't find that gate previously, did I? Yeah, I don't think so. Let me see if I can get back safely. Cause I know this is open now. Just good news for me. Oh, oh, okay, I think I just made things worse. So unfortunately, I gotta deal with all them again. It would've been nice to be able to afford all the, uh... Like, all the stuff for the shop. But I guess I wasn't as lucky. So now I gotta go through all this again. And I have no more cocktails. I'm gonna have oil urns, but I don't want to use the oil urns yet. Oh, I have to go down here. God damn it. They're not making it any easy for me. Oh well, that's that's what you gotta deal with with these uh, Soulsborne games. Don't expect them to hold back in any shape or form. You can bet your ass they're not gonna do that. What the hell? It was you, wasn't it? Of course. How dare you? Mom, I ever tell you not to shoot someone in the back? Of course, because not even Mama will want to do anything with you. The heathen. Do I dare open that gate? Wait, I don't think I was able to open this one, right? Yeah, this one does not open. That's pretty stupid. Would have liked to have been able to cut across that way. But that option does not exist. Sucks to be me. Oh boy. I think I'm just gonna have to up it. Nope! Nope! I got comboed by every hit. <laughs> I I am dead. What are you talking about? Don't don't say that shit to me when I'm already gone, because now you just look like a bunch of cowards. Man, that was thousands of blood echoes that are now gone. It was going so well until that time. Oh my god. <laughs>
Can I get this? Another bloodstone shard. God, how many more of these am I gonna pick up? In the course of this episode, let alone the entire Let's Play. If only I had a map to see if I was anywhere near the gate before. Oh damn, I forgot about this. Oh, so one power hit kills him. Well, that makes things easier. Hold on, where are my pebbles? I should probably get them equipped next. Yeah, I'll use them to distract enemies. That might be the best laid out plan. We'll see how well that works for me. <laughs> Again, I kind of wish you could open this portal house right here. Like, that would have saved me a bit of grief. Rather than just walk around past the mob again. Do I dare want to fight this guy? If I can get the gate opened, we'll do it. Close by a device. Oh, now where's the device? Is it up here? Gotta go find where that device is. I think that's gonna be my primary focus. Look for what operates that gate. Oh, it's the one for the other side. I thought it was the one I found a while back. God damn it. Hey. Rover. You're not a very smart dog, are you? I'm gonna throw that out there. Let me see if I can distract him. You know, without getting shot. Oops, kinda rolled into that swing. Well, that was dumb. <laughs> uh, is that all the threats? Are nope! What if I use something with a little bit more range? Whoa, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute! We're gonna be doing this trick again, huh? I need more blood. It's never enough. Oh! I didn't parry him! It didn't work! I didn't time it right. Oh my god. Okay! That was a painful one. At least I beat him again. It was just a worse performance than the previous one. You gotta go away. You've been pissing me off for too long. Yeah, you showed that, uh... That water pump who's boss. Go you, Rover. Go you, indeed. <laughs> oh, can I finally make it to that gate with the lantern? Wait, I don't think I went to this side. Could I have gone here earlier and saved myself a lot of trouble? No, I think I was here before. Yeah, this is not gonna save me any trouble. I'm still in the same spot. Reeks of Hound. Okay, now I'm down here. I didn't go this way before. Is this how to get back up? 
Yes, okay. Well, the good news is I didn't take any fall damage. But where is this gonna end up? Okay, now I'm intrigued. Wait. Uh, am I gonna have to drop? I don't wanna drop. Because what if I take too much damage? I guess I'll have to take this one. And it's just a little bit of fall damage. Not a lot. It's tolerable. Can't grab the ladder from the side. That would have been very nice. Looks like I'm in some sewer. Hello. Oh, this one seems a bit tougher than the previous ones. So I gotta be really careful with them. You seem a lot more feral. Get fucked. Please. I'm asking you kindly to get fucked. Okay, this one's got a nastier combo. lots of blood too I like that that's gonna be very nice oh there's rats Ugh. I'm not feeling rats I'm not feeling all this either okay I landed on the plank good stuff no oh, I want to get the item thick cool blood Let's see if I can do this. Yes! It worked! Let's hope I didn't aggro all the other rats. Oh, shit, Taki mushrooms! Here we're going for it! Oh, oh my god. Ooh, hunter equipment. Okay, this is better. Has less poison resistance, though. And this is better, too. So if I'm going to be dealing with poison, this is slightly worse. However, at least I'll have more defense. And I think I'd rather overall defense than, you know, just worrying about poison. Hey. Hey. Just pretend I'm a hunk of cheese. Come on. Let's freaking go. Let me see who's on the other side of this. Huh, you missed, pal. More throwing knives. Okay, what is the point of this waterway? Okay, so they sniff and then they jump. That's how I gotta worry about them. What was not like Shadowgate 64 where if you walk too far you end up drowning? Oh, that would have been a shitty time. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, what did I just do? I hit up. I think I just made my bullets stronger? Yeah, I... I meant to heal, not do what I did with the bullets. I don't even know if it's safe to just drop down. Yeah, I don't think I'm really supposed to go this way right now. At least I can't trust myself to not die doing this. Let's just pull it back a little. 
think if I just go across here, I might be okay. Unless it's all a dead end. I know it is on this side. What about the other one? There might be another ladder that I overlooked. No? Huh. Okay, I'm kind of lost. I'm just wondering if there was like a fake door, like something that was boarded up. And I'm not seeing it. So I think I should just leave the sewer and then head on back to where those big wolves were. I think I have to fight past them. Which I'm not looking forward to doing because we all know how that worked last time. However, I might be okay. Let me get my throwing knives equipped. Wait. Okay, that just changes my weapon. What if I hit down? Okay, here we go. Alright, let me hit up again. I don't even know what that did. So I guess I'll just forget about it. Wait a minute, can I go back? Or am I stuck? I can't even walk around this. Well, yes I can. I just had to smash open the coffin. If only there was just a ladder that I could have used to get back here. So I know I was this way before. If I have to run past the wolves, I'll, I might do that too. I think the real mistake was that I got myself caught in the corner. All right, here we go, let's try it. Maybe I can only piss off one. Okay, and it's working. Come on, go for it. Oh, come on! It aggroed the other one automatically? Oh my god, again! The wolves got me again! Well, this is a sign of things to come. It really is. I just wanted to get past the walls, and then I can't do it. Oh, why did the other one get aggroed when I did nothing to it? It's gonna be one of those days, huh? Watch now, I bet you I could open up a shortcut earlier, and I just didn't know how. <laughs> it's gonna come to that, isn't it? Well, I guess I'll just stop here, and in the next part, I'll meet you on that bridge. See everyone, thanks for watching.